Previously on a love parallel. Buongiorno, Sofia. Buongiorno, professore. Io mi chiamo Luca. Sofia. Sì, lo so. Come lo sai? Io voglio te. La nostra storia è tutta rovinata. Non ci tocchiamo più così. Non mi guardi più così. Sofia, se ti racconto come ci siamo allontanati, tu l'accetteresti solo come una realtà inevitabile. E non lo è. È solo una possibilità. Does fighting for their love count when he doesn't even know if he can commit to it fully? Like I can? Like she deserves? Cosa, cosa vuol dire che ti togli anni di vita ogni volta che viaggi? Eh, il prezzo da pagare per trascendere tra le vite parallele. Non tornare più, ti prego. No, ti devo vedere. I never thought I would be the other woman. But if his girlfriend is another version of me in a parallel universe, does that even count? The Many Worlds Interpretation is a theory first explored in 1957 that suggests that every time an action is taken that has multiple possible outcomes, the universe replicates itself, and an identical world is born for every alternative outcome. Not all the parallels were aware that they were essentially a replica of an original world. The Sophia you know, the Sophia I am falling for, she's a derivative, that's what they call us. We live in a derivative world that is a byproduct of a primary universe. The parallel enforcement agency should have known that people like Luca would inevitably try to hack the system, but this was back when parallel travel was only for the rich, the powerful, or the reckless. I just got into Rome. Give me an update. Target is Sophia Walker, 28 years old. Derivative of the primary Sophia Walker, also in Rome, in a relationship with Luca Lombardi. Derivative was born in Australia, resident in Rome for five years, fluent in Italian, no prior record of parallel travel. And relationship status with fugitive Luca Lombardi? Undefined. We've followed them for three months. There appears to be an ongoing affair. So far, he's aged three years on account of the trips he's made to see her from his primary universe. We've tried tracking his online activity but it's likely he's using a shield for all parallel exit searches. We'll find a way to penetrate the shield and give me more data. Have we had any results on her transcendent levels yet? No, uh, we didn't class her as an A-grade threat. So far, there have been no attempts by Luca Lombardi to transport her through the parallels. Not yet, but he will. I want a blood sample taken and her transcendent abilities analyzed by the Rome office as soon as possible. Do not underestimate Miss Walker. She has a friendship with derivative Professor Bertolucci. But he's been dormant for years. I don't care. I want that girl tracked in our system. Hello? Hey, Taylor, can you hear me? I mean, uh, yeah, yes, 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 I can hear you. I, I didn't know what your accent was going to be like. Oh, right. No, I, I, I'm, I'm not Italian. I, I live in Italy, but I'm, uh, I have a strange accent because I've kind of lived all over. Yeah, I know. I, I Googled you. Oh. Uh, um, I'm sorry. Is that, is that weird? <laughs> uh, you're a, you are a very gifted writer. You, you read my writing? I, I mean, I read a, a few of your pieces. I was, uh, I was curious about you. I'm sorry, I hope that's okay. Of course. Um, listen, th thank you for getting back to me. I, I really loved the, the theories in your article, and um, I'm just, I'm, I'm not an expert on quantum mechanics, so I, I have a few questions, if that's okay. You're scared. What? Gabby, yeah, I mean, you're, you're nervous. I can hear it in your, in your voice, but not about talking to me. Are, are you in some kind of trouble, or...? Um, do you know what, Taylor? Actually, maybe I should just uh, email you the questions. Uh, uh, no, uh, Sophia, wait. I'm I'm sorry. I, I I don't I don't mean to pry. I I have this habit of articulating my inner monologue. Uh, it freaks people out sometimes. My mom says, Taylor, just keep those thoughts to yourself. Don't go analyzing people when you first meet them. Not that I not that I live with my mom. I I have my own place. But you know, yeah, we we talk. Right. Um. Anyway, some people. 
uh, good people make you just want to be completely honest. Have you have you ever noticed that? Yeah, actually, I have. Uh, so you you want to understand my theory on the many worlds interpretation? Yes, um, if that's okay. <laughs> Uh, well, do you understand the basics? Well, uh, from what I understand, there's like a primary world in which every time someone makes a choice, uh, derivative worlds form in which every potential possibility is lived out, right? And, and, and you believe that we are living in one of those derivative worlds. Oh, uh, yeah, well, it's a bit more... Sorry, um, I, I know I probably made it sound really reductive, but I'm just... No, I, I realize that it, it sounds a little crazy, but if... Uh, no, if you no, no, Taylor, Taylor, it doesn't sound crazy. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, hey, I, I have to get back to the lab right now. Oh, okay, uh, sorry. If, if, you, if you want to chat later tonight, uh, yes. six hours ahead in New York, right? That would be great. Thank you. Great. Uh, exactly what part of traveling between parallel universes did you want to understand? Everything. Okay. So, uh, was I in love with her after our first conversation? Maybe. Probably. Uh, yes. Fine. You want the truth? I... I couldn't stop smiling, thinking about our first conversation. You think that that's naive or, or superficial? Why? I mean, animals operate on their instincts all the time, deciding within seconds if, if, if another creature is a threat or not. So why are human beings so scared of letting their intuition guide their decisions? I read the agency's reports on Luca. I saw him. Well, I, I mean, I kind of hacked some Rome surveillance footage and saw him with her. He doesn't understand Sophia like I do. Was I supposed to just forget about pursuing her because of some small detail like timing? Him meeting her first? I, I was sure that she felt something on that call. Ophelia was the only person Sophia had told the whole story to. So you're in love with him? No, I mean, I know it's funny. Sophia, but... I get it. He's in Belfigo. You haven't gotten any for a while. Oh, and I've heard so that the Italian. So. No, no, no. Grazie. Ci vediamo là. I saw the two of you in the piazza that day. If he touched me like that, I'd grab him by the hair and say, Look, honey, to hell with parallels. Your universe begins and ends in my bed in Basta. <laughs> but you're totally getting played here. Why do you always do that? Like, can't you believe that sometimes some people are acting without a selfish ulterior motive? He's come to see you, what, two times? And then he goes back to his world where his girlfriend, who is a parallel version of you, is waiting for him. But it's basically over between them. No. You are totally. Really, uh, no, you don't. Play you don't know. It's not like that. Oh, I'm sorry. You dropped this fucking bombshell on me about parallel universes, no, and I'm supposed to get past all of that and then move on to support your little crush, which frankly is not even the most part of this whole story. I know, I know, but uh, Ophelia, I need you, okay? I need you to help me work out how Luke can stay in this parallel. Jesus, Sophia, you're out of your depth. Like anyone who had just fallen in love, Sophia was distracted optimistic, more determined than ever to find a way for Luca to live in her derivative parallel without his aging being accelerated. If everything you're telling me is true, I know, I believe you, it's just, well then, this is not a game, okay? You cannot defy the laws of physics. I, I know, I know, but I know we have this technology. It's not like he exists in the future. I don't know, I, 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 it's just down to chance, I guess, because the guy who invented the technology the, the professor, he lives here in Rome and he's one of those guys that plays chess, you We're know? Piazza del Fico? Yeah, so the professor in Luca's world, he 
got the equation right, he, he invented the technology, but his derivative in our world just didn't go down the same path for some reason. Luca's going to rock up after a year of monthly visits and you're going to be shagging some old dude. No, for real, this guy is dying at an accelerated rate, and for what? For some girl who believes all of his ludicrous declarations of love just because he screwed things up with the original version of you in his universe? Celia, come on. I like him. I really you like him. You just want him because you can't have no, him. No, no, it's not it. Yes, it is, because men come easily for you, and this one is a challenge. No. And in your head, this is love, because you're a writer, and in your romantic vision of the world, love equals tragedy and suffering. You know what I've been through. You know that I've basically given up on finding a love like this, and I know the whole power thing is crazy. But I have never felt like this, Fuda. Yeah, and you literally don't understand the consequences. No, of course I do. I know there are risks. That's why I called you, because I am terrified of everything, like Luca, that parallels everything. But you know what? You treat me like I'm this fool because I'm trusting someone and, and risking everything for one of the greatest human experiences, which is to be vulnerable and to love someone. Okay, Bello, what is that, a line from the latest novel that you haven't written? Just, just forget it. Like, Sophia. I not even asked you. I don't even... Sophia. Sophia, be careful. You don't know what you're doing. The way I see it, Luca may have been the original catalyst for her interest in all this, but as Sophia would soon discover, her personal connection to the parallels ran so much deeper. before I uh I, I'm just anxious because I I can't speak to Luca and I don't know when he's coming back and uh and I guess everything you're saying actually makes a lot of sense and I don't know Philly, I don't I don't want to find out that he's using me and that that, that this whole thing is just I don't know an illusion <laughs> but I can't walk away, Ophelia. I, everything reminds me of him. I can't stop thinking about him, and and I and I want to try. So you can you can tell me. I told you so. If it all blows up in my face. Um. Anyway, you've been so amazing, believing me with this whole parallel thing, and I and I and I'm very grateful to you. So uh, I hope uh, we're still okay. Um, call me later, okay? Right. Sofia. Ci conosciamo? Tre anni fa sul treno per Venezia. Abbiamo parlato. Eh, mi spiace, non mi ricordo. Dovevo darti il mio numero, ma tu sei uscita di corsa perché hai paura di perdere la fermata. Ho pensato molto a quel giorno. Mi spiace, io devo andare perché ho un appuntamento. Con il professore. Chi sei? Vincenzo. Ma ci conosciamo. Mi stavi seguendo? Sofia Luca non ti ama. Non ti conosce. Io sì. Da quel giorno non ho mai smesso di pensarti. Non mi toccare, eh? Luca non viene a trovarti. Sono il primario. Vengo dal mondo di Luca. Ma abito qui con voi derivativi. Come? Come riesci a restare qua? Senza accelerare gli anni? Ho dei privilegi. Sei dell'agenzia? Ah, ora ti interesso, eh? Ora sei curiosa. Sofia, io posso aiutarti. Io posso aiutarti, Fia, posso aiutarti. Devi fidarti di me, Sofia. No, no. Devi fidarti di me. No, no, no. lasciami andare, non ho bisogno di te. Luca non ti ha detto che viaggia illegalmente. Lo cattureremo. Ma vediamo con chi vorrei stare. Sofia, io ti conosco. Ma lei lo sa? 
Certo che lo so. Ma io pensavo che in questa dimensione lei non avesse ancora inventato la tecnologia delle parallele. L'8 maggio 2016 il mio primario è venuto dalla vita parallela di Luca per avvisarmi che fosse meglio non continuare le ricerche. Per dirmi che la tecnologia che lui aveva inventato per viaggiare tra le parallele non ci aiuta. Quando dai diverse possibilità ad un uomo non si impegna mai su una. Una vita con troppe scelte genera una pigrizia, una mancanza di pazienza per il tempo che ci vuole per creare qualcosa di bello, di sostanza. Insomma, io voglio una vita semplice, Sofia. Ma prima o poi la tecnologia arriverà anche qua, no? Sì, ma non voglio esserne coinvolta. Professore... Sofia, tu sei una brava ragazza e non voglio che ti facciano male. E ti faranno male se continui così. La gente che gestisce questa tecnologia è malata, spietata. Ma ah, allora devono essere fermati, no? Cioè, dobbiamo provare a fermarli. Ti ho visto con Luca, so chi è. Ma lui sta rischiando la sua vita e anche la tua. Ieri ho conosciuto una dell'agenzia. Come si chiamava? Vincenzo. Ma questo Vincenzo proviene da un mondo primario, ma abita qua in un mondo derivativo. Come fa? No, no, non possiamo combattere contro di loro. Professore, io amo Luca. Lo amo. Come fai a fidarti di lui? Sei sicura che ne valga la pena? Sinceramente non lo so. Ma forse questo non si può mai garantire con chiunque. Bisogna provare a credere in qualcosa, no? Io preferirei provare a fidarmi di qualcuno piuttosto che diventare insensibile a tutto. Forse c'è qualcosa che possiamo provare a fare. When the primary professor came across the parallels, It wasn't just to warn his derivative not to continue his work. He came to hide his latest equations in a small 15th century library, the Biblioteca Casanatense. He was paranoid about the agency listening and watching his every move, so he left his derivative with a single clue so that if he were ever desperate and needed to locate the equations, he could work out which book they were hidden in. I due combattenti più forti. Che significa? Non lo so. Non lo so. Lei che cosa associa con i combattenti? Non so, potrebbe essere un libro nascosto fra due atlanti di due paesi conosciuti per i loro combattenti, non so. Ma nella storia chi sono stati i combattenti più conosciuti? Ce ne sono tanti? Sarebbero i romani. Abbiamo Araclis. No, ma pure, pure i greci, i cinesi. Ci devo pensare. Forse quando andrai là nella biblioteca avrà un senso questo indizio. Sofia, ascoltami bene. Ti staranno già cercando. Quindi se vai nella biblioteca, desterai il sospetto che c'è qualcosa di nascosto di importante lì. Quindi o vai lì, lo trovi subito e lo porti direttamente qua. O non ci vai per niente. Non possiamo rischiare che trovino quel libro. Ok, ci, ci provo domani. Per quanto riguarda l'indizio, se mi viene in mente qualcosa, ti faccio sapere subito. Magari. Professore, grazie. In bocca al lupo. Salve, posso entrare? Mi dispiace, la biblioteca è chiusa. Pensavo che fosse aperta fino alle 18 oggi, no? No, oggi no. Posso entrare solo un attimo? Perché forse l'altro giorno ho lasciato un libro mio qua. L'altro giorno? Sì. Signorina, io lavoro qua da otto anni, tutti i giorni. E non l'ho mai vista. Forse è meglio se lei se ne va. Ophelia, hey, um, look, this isn't a good time. Can I, can I call you back? Sofia, what's wrong? Sofia, I was walking home and one of those guys from the Parallel Enforcement Agency tried to take me. What? Are you okay? Well, I got away, but these guys aren't messing around. I need to see you right now, in person. Look, Hilly, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm gonna fix this, okay? I've gotta go. Sì, è qui nella biblioteca. Sto cercando qualcosa. Sì. Lasciatele trovare quello che cerca. Poi la prendi.
Intentional parallels. Miss Walker was recorded in the house of Professor Carlo Bertolucci 23 hours ago. Whatever he sent her to find, I want to with the agency. I repeat, do not let the target leave that library. That was copy. Come on, think, Sophia. Think, think, think. The, the, the greatest, the greatest worries, the, the, the strongest worries. The... Time. The most powerful worries are these two. Patience. Time. It's Tolstoy. It's War and Peace. It's War and Peace. It's got to be. It's got to be that. It's got to be War and Peace. Oh, gosh. Rome office, can we get an aerial visual of the library highlighting all exits? We're on it now. She's in the Biblioteca Casa Tenente Via di Sant'Ignazio. We have a flight team arriving at the Colosseum and a car waiting for their transfer. Uh, ready to copy. Target coordinates, 31 uniform. Yes, sir. Roger. Reply, 45. Thank you. Get out. Go. I'm approving all force necessary to detain the target. She is not to be eliminated as she's a key link to fugitive Luca Lombardi. So long as she's alive, we'll keep crossing the parallels. I want them taken out together. Arrow two copies. Yeah. Professor, Guerre Pace è una riga da Guerre Pace di Tolstoy. Non c'è nulla di più forte di quei due competenti là. Tempo e pazienza. Ma certo, ma certo, come fatto a pensarci. Brava. Ce l'ho anch'io, Guerre Pace. Allora, se il mio primario avesse una copia dello stesso libro, avrebbe una copertina rossa, capito? Ok. Intentional parallels. Team has landed and are on their way. I repeat, team has landed and are on their way. 40 seconds out. Is there any damage? The target is to resume. Standard loadout. The fight on, fight on. Fight on, fight on. Move I want this uh, contacts. That was copy killed, that was clean. Fight on, fight on. Fight on, fight on. Master tech. The play round. Two, I will give one more shot with the... Mom, we've lost visual on target, Professor Bertolucci. Team Delta is still on the ground in pursuit. Senza sapere chi sei. Smettila di fare la stupida. Sono dalla tua parte, anche se non capisci nulla di parallele. Oppure provo ad avvertirti prima, ma eravamo davanti alle telecamere. No, mi stai mettendo. L'agenzia non sospetta di me. Non sanno che conosco il professore. No, se, 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 se lui ti avesse conosciuto me l'avrebbe detto. Se tu adesso esci da qua, ti prenderanno. Ruberanno le equazioni, rovinerai tutto. Come posso fidarmi di te? Fidati. C'è più tempo. No, aspetta. Tu hai detto che lavori qua da otto anni, giusto? Sì. Allora in quali anni è venuto il professore a nascondere qui il libro? Ok, va bene. Ok, va bene. Ok, va bene. Che cos'è? Che c'è nel seringa? Rome office, give me an update. They gave her a double dose of C500, so we'll be able to analyze her full parallel transcendent levels. Target was released on Via di San Francesco, but she poses no threat. After level 10 blood extraction, she'll be too weak to cross any parallels for at least 12 hours. We'll have her blood results confirmed by 0600. Hai visto Sofia? Oggi non l'ho vista per niente. Non lo lasciare. La sto aiutando. 
detto non la toccare. Chi sei tu? Sei dell'agenzia? Io l'ho aiutato a fuggire dall'agenzia. Se ci tiene la sua vita, dia la testata della tua ragazza di stare lontana dalle parallele. Eh? Io non ho paura né di te né di quelli dell'agenzia. Adesso vattene via, ti spacco la faccia. Eccomi, scusa mio amore. Ho fallito, ho fallito, c'era questo libro molto importante e dentro c'erano scritte le equazioni e, e l'hanno rubato, l'hanno preso. No, 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 non ascoltami, sei stata bravissima. No, ma... Sei stata bravissima. Ho deciso non ti lascerò mai più, non mi importa di nient'altro. No, ma c'è questo uomo dell'agenzia, Vincenzo. Ti ha toccato? Lui è molto pericoloso, lui. Se ti ha fatto del male, giuro che lo ammazzo. Non avrei mai dovuto lasciarti da sola. Ora ti porto al sicuro. E poi dalla caccia a tutti. Mom, we just got the blood results back on Sophia Walker. Her transcendent levels are off the charts. We've never recorded anyone scoring higher than 82. With that score, she has the ability to travel unassisted and undetected by our tracking system into any parallel primary or derivative. Luca? Luca?